Good. What's up, YouTube? My name is hey. Justin from Party Rental Knowledge. I'm here at the ARA show with Granite Industries and Jeff and uh, Jeremy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. You're good. I'm Jeremy Roop here at Granite. Uh, so we're basically just uh, here at ARA. I wanted to go through the Granite Industry booth. Um, not too many people know about Granite. They hear about they hear about their smaller carts, but their electric carts are insane. I like well, I maybe a bunch of people heard about Granite, but I just didn't know I just bought, how much you guys actually do. That's I just right bought here. two. You just bought two? Yeah, I just bought two. Yeah, it's 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 awesome. So they make construction stuff. Like we got some bakers and stuff over here. They got a motorized baker. These are some like concrete dollies, some like equipment or material handlers, pretty much. But we're here for rental stuff. So, party rental stuff. We got like, what, this is your smallest electric dolly, right? Yeah, this is kind of our entry level transformer, all around utility car. Uh, this front plate actually swaps out. So you can uh, put on different attachments based on the intended uh, application there. You can put a fork attachment on, you can put our multi mover attachment on. And just uh, yeah, uh, and now you're ready to rock and roll. So, really allows uh, the most versatility. It revised for this year, um, really based on feedback we got from uh, customers in the past. Um, yeah, that's cool. The, uh, yeah, we made it a foot taller than our old version. Uh -huh. And we got our loop handles here, so it's a foot grip down here. So. Really um, optimizing leverage, pulling the car back. We also upgrade the battery pack on it, so you got an all-day battery on it. So um, this is, yeah, like I said, if you're just looking for something to kind of get going in the special event industry, uh, this is going to be a great all-around car. You can use it for a ton of stuff. Um, but this is brand new over here, which is really one of the exciting things we have here at the show. The big herd, right? Yes, yeah, right. Yep. So this thing, I like. You can put eight-foot tables on it six foot tables it's wide enough to put tables on it that's like my favorite thing about it because i feel like none of the other dollies are like they don't do they like, can't really put tables on it they're really awkward or if you do you got to put it on its face to kind of get the stability i don't do that you know what i mean i'm not yeah, yeah. so but then like this thing is just it's so beefy man it's so yeah awesome. and that's exactly what we were going for when we designed this car um the guy that we worked with uh brandon eric stream he's been here on monday and tuesday but He's off partying right now, I think, um, today, but he helped us design this car, and he wanted an all-around car that he could do anything with. And he, the, the uh, motor on this is 950 watts, it's the biggest in the industry, and it uh, packs a serious punch when you get a move Forward and reverse. I haven't tried this yet. 350 pounds. That's locked. But like, if it dies, he was showing me too. There's a switch down here. Yeah. If you flip this switch when it dies, yeah. is it up? There you go. Yeah. Now it'll free move. Yeah. I Maybe mean, it didn't switch it. Oh, you got, it's got to be off too. See? I'll know this stuff once I own one. Right? That's right. That's right. <laughs> Just those little things. But yeah, that's sick. You said it takes like a, like a charge lasts like a day and a half, you said? Uh, full, easily a full day. We've had guys in the field that haven't charged them for three days and it still works great. Uh, still all greens, but it's got the biggest battery pack on the market, 39 amp hour battery pack. Um, it's got your indicator lights right here so you can see exactly where your percent's at. You can see we're still at 100 after this. Yeah, you got an actual display. Yeah, three and a half mile an hour, uh, up inclines, through grass. What's hills, the weight rating on this? 950 pounds. But uh, we have uh, tested it past that, um, and it's worked out really well. So, a true all-around cart for anyone in the special event industry. Uh, like I said, tables, chairs, inflatables. Uh, it's got it all. So. Zero turn so, radius. So, uh, we can actually shut the power off and still just, you know, spin it around. Uh, we got safety features that we've been building on these carts. We've been doing carts, electric power carts, for over 10 years. Um, and so we've got a ton of safety features building, like that auto locking you saw. 
uh, direct drive transaxle, um, just one of the best ones you can get on the market. Uh, zero maintenance, just plug it in and away you go. I love that it has this Like it's got this bar, when you got a big inflatable, you can put it. And then he was telling me too, this. So you see how tall it is? You might think, oh, this isn't gonna fit in my trailer. Well, in reality, come over here, Adam. In reality, this can go down to this level, and this sits at this level right here. He was showing me that, because I have a six foot trailer, so I already, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. He was showing me that too. Yep, yep. Flat free dual leg tires, flat free everywhere on this car, so you never have to worry about pumping the tires up. It's, it's a true zero maintenance car. Just plug it in. This thing is the biggest go. car I've seen in the industry so far, hands down. It's you're definitely uh, giving Jolly Dolly and you're giving freaking Jerry Shepherds to run for their money. Hey, we like what they do and we just want to get in the game. Now we think we got a pretty good entry. They gotta try and go after this car now because this is the biggest one for sure. Yeah, I think it's got, I think you got the biggest rating right now too. Yeah, and uh, we also as an added feature on ours is a removable battery pack as well. Um, so. I'm just gonna, I'll demonstrate the kickstand here for you too, yeah, just real. Yeah, and then we're charging the battery pack here. So if you are ever are in a pinch, you know, we know downtime is the enemy of these carts. Um, you just quick, you pop it out, you can set another battery pack right back in. So I That's think we're cool. the only uh, cart in the industry that has a removable rechargeable battery pack like that. So. That's sick. Just added it, added feature. Like I said, if you want to stay up and running when you're out in the field. There you go. That's a that's a serious game changer. I didn't know the battery pack was yep. removed. Yep. Yeah. But we're we're not done. We got more than just dollies here too. We got other dollies here. These are your basic ones that are not motorized, right? Yep. Yep. So these this has been our bread and butter uh, for about 20 years. Um, is these these hand trucks right here? We keep making them better every year. Uh, in fact. Just this year for this uh, show, we added a reinforced rib design here all the way up. And then you actually can get a bolt kit for this. It's a grade five bolt just for extra weight capacity. <coughs> so we're always listening to customers and we're always making it better and better and better. So. Okay, well, you gotta listen to me. All mine break right here. Is that why that's added? That's why we added it. That's exactly why we added it. Yep. Okay, I've had to pay welders to weld in yep. a bar. So that's a reinforced design based on customer feedback there. Okay. This one's sick stronger. for moving trailers. You make that. You yep. told me you could put that on the material mover, the like smaller one, to move trailers around too. That you have a motorized trailer mover as well, right? Yep, yep, yep. We got your dolly with a winch. Yep. It's, uh, revised everything on this. Um, it's got that movable handle at the top too. I see that. Yeah, so you can drop it down a little bit if you need to. Uh, but we got these, like, it's called infinite grip handles here. Um, that's something that we feature on a lot of our cars. We have it on our big hurt. We're, again, we're the only people in the industry that do this. So when you're pulling your cart back, you want to be able to get your optimal leverage point. And so these, these handles let you move. So the whole time, you get a grip when you're pulling the cart back. This makes it really easy to pull it back, and it adds a lot of safety to the cart pulling back. And then we got, of course, our E-straps here that we build into everything. That we sell almost every day. We sell. had them on the handle too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we got these, uh, same on the, uh, the on big the herc over there. We also have the D ring. These are designed for just like your basic D ring ratchet straps right here on the side. That's awesome. so. yeah, it's really cool. And you got a winch on it? Yeah, 3,500 pound winch. See, I thought this was cool too. I was thinking, like, what do you think about this? I was, I was thinking these are cool. For, uh, for resin chairs? No, for wood chairs that don't lock together. You know? For wood chairs? Yeah, it keeps them locked in. I was gonna put resins on them. At least the resins went locked though. You can go up to 30 resins on there. You can go to 30? Yep. Yeah. Yep. I only stand 25 when I'm doing uh, moving around. I think next time we should put a wood chair in there because okay. the wood chairs don't lock. Oh, okay, okay. And they're really hard to put on a dolly. That's but good. with that, they lock. They sure. Lock. sure. The resin locks. These are cool too. I like this, like, you got like a little chair mover here. Yeah, that so fits into these specialized dollars. One of the things we always hear is you got to be able to move chairs and then through grass, right? Right. So uh, this is we've had this car for a little while now, and same thing. We keep making it better and better. So we actually have some uh, mattress boards here. That's what we call them. Um, they get your chair pallets. You can stack chairs up to 50 high. That's got 47 on it. Um, e strap them down. Like I said, we got our e straps on everything. And then you come at it um, with this car. This is an all around car just on its own. But it's specifically designed to work with this chair pallet here. And it just locks 
in, you nest it, no problem. Boom. Right back. We got a loop handle design, stronger design, easier to drag. Now you can go through grass, up and down hills. They ain't tipping really either. No, it's a super simple car. Yeah, it's uh, been, been a good seller for us, especially this show. But everyone's got problems with it chairs and so uh, they can buy you know people buy like 12 bases they buy 12 of those chair pallets at the bottom and then just use one cart and there you go okay what about what about this one uh, this one's cool i, I, I like this one double shivari chair mover so you can stack them quite a bit higher here we just kind of show this in demonstration um but yeah again rear swivel wheels um what we hear all the time about shivaris is we hate moving them and so, yeah um, we're just trying to uh, create some movers here that yeah, help make that job a little easier. Sure that's little one safer. of those regular dollies that they also do the yeah. so, single, and then you can also do your uh, X-back chairs. That's what this is designed for. You can come in from the back on an X-back chair, uh, and then it also flips up and locks in place. You can just use it as a basic hand truck and a pinch, too. So that's kind of a three-in-one. Uh, here we go. There's the X-back chair there. So, yeah, the X-back is cool. Uh, that's one thing about X-Pack chairs, they're all, they're all different. This one looks we'll, a little small. We'll, anyway. edit, we'll edit that one yeah, out. Yeah, 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 you're good. Well, you want to order that one? That's all right. No, no, that's, Don't that, order that chair. Do you guys collab with... Uh, yeah, that one just comes in a bit. Right. Do you guys collab with Block and Roll, too? Yeah, Basis so uh, a couple years ago, Block and Roll came to us, and he said, we know you make really good hand trucks, and we got a really good design. Would you make our hand trucks for us? And so we're like, yeah, we can do that. So. We, we kind of work with them to develop this one here, um, which is a little lighter weight. It's got our loop handle. Again, you'll notice that. Um, really versatile hand truck. And then he knew our reputation in the uh, electric powered industry. And so that's when the e mover came on the scene. Um, but yeah, flat free tires everywhere. And a uh, really, really that's solid start. That's yeah. Wild. I yeah. remember when he, he used to, you guys did, like, did some work to these before. He used to actually have put some leverage into these. Yeah. This is like. Oh yeah, there's a lot of revisions going to get that cart just right, um, but we've had it out now for over two years, I think. And oh, is that a styrofoam block? That's it? Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm sitting here thinking it's concrete. I'm like, why is this so light? This is amazing. Like, what's yeah. going on? We, uh, can I heard a squeak. Engineer a lot of things, but we can't make a, can't make a 500 block. I'm like, like, why does it feel so light? I'm like, I'm curious. And then this is, yeah, this is our e-mover here. So again, that was, they came to us and said, you know, hey, can can uh, you develop you uh, electric power? And, and so we're, we're right now we've got our standard, you know, 400 watt motor on this, but we're looking at making even bigger uh, motors for the future for 700 pound blocks going up and down hills, uh, grass hills and all that stuff. So uh, this has been a huge seller as well. And this is just like another forks kind of like versatile dolly or something? Yeah, or? so this is it's called our multi-fork and uh, really is designed as a, again, more feedback from the special event industry. We used to bring a fork truck that was about this tall and everyone's just like, you gotta make it taller and you gotta make it with better handles. And so um, this is kind of our top of the line version. We make a stripped down version that would be just this frame with a single set of wheels, no rear wheels in the back. Um, and this actually has two wheel positions on this one here and here. So um, it's kind of like a generic block mover if you need one of those. And then also um, just, uh, again, kick plate here, loop handle design, just a, a double reinforced all the way down. So it's just really a beefy cart um, for anything in the special event industry. So we make three versions of that. This one, Yo. a two-wheel, and then a single wheel. So. I'm buying this, by the way. Just so you guys know, you'll see this in my warehouse. Because uh, this is the perfect steak rack. Um, you can literally stack these on top of each other, yep. two of these on top of each other. But then, you got, then you got the mover. So does the stick, uh, that price include this and the roller? No, the roller is separate. Okay. So actually, most people just buy the racks, um, and then you can just move buy them. one roller. Yeah. Or you, oh, you're telling me you, you put this under a pallet jack? Yeah. Right? So this was designed to actually fit a standard pallet jack underneath, and obviously a forklift or anything like that. So most guys will just have you know stack them up two or three tall, and of course our e strap pockets again. Um, I mean load security. We can. Well, I want it so I can roll it in and out of my trailer, and yeah. I can't get the pallet jack in yeah. and out of my trailer. Well, then yeah, you just buy the rolling is, base. That'd be perfect and for it. And it, because I, I don't want to put a permanent steak rack in my truck. Right. And this is perfect for strapping to the wall. Like, this and we got like, brakes back there on it too. So you okay, can, I didn't even know about yeah, that. Yeah, lock the casters in place. I was already sold before that. Yeah, yeah. And now I'm like, wow. Yeah. And then these, real quick, I want, these are sick. Like, how, how do they go together? Yeah, you just, uh, you can, yeah, just any way you want, really. Yep, that's it. And this side? Yeah. Yep. 
just like floor. Yeah, and you can make it any shape you want based on what you're hauling. Oh wow, I didn't even think about that. But yeah, super high quality casters, uh, really strong, durable design there. Maybe make it, make it into a skateboard if you want, it's kind of whatever you want to do. All right. As well. These are cool. And then just another dolly. How many dollies do you have? Um, do you have like an actual count here? Yeah, we probably got 20, <laughs> 20, 25, but that's just a, still a fraction of what we carry. We carry full lines of all this stuff. So. It's not the customization on each one and stuff, like in different <laughs> styles and all that. Well, our best ideas come from the uh, from this show, really. I mean, what almost is, every idea here has come from being at the ARA show, listening to our customers. This is like the one thing I haven't heard about. What is this? So this is, a, it's called our cross country wagon. Um, designed for like tent poles and uh, really anything huge that needs to go across like grass or uneven terrain. So it comes standard with like two ends like this, but then it's got an eight foot pole in the middle. And then this is completely adjustable. So like, this is only a four foot here, but there's an extension that goes on it. And so you can like move these back wheels wherever you need to, uh, just to optimize it for, for length. And you can, some people even get longer poles. They'll get like, a, by their own 30 foot pole and just run it back and they'll just haul crazy that's lengths of, of Yeah, that's stuff. interesting. So it's kind of just a utility wagon, um, you know, 585 oh, boxes. It's, cool. it's a good all-around You got five car. minutes with me. But. All right, man, I appreciate you for, like, taking the time to... Uh, like, let's not... You want to check, you want to check this? Let's not forget to mention... I think oh, I was you guys... Some of the best staging. Yeah, I, didn't even, I, didn't even, I didn't even realize Oh, yeah, that. we got staging here, signature. That's our steel. We got aluminum. Full line of staging products and then... Our racking, this has actually been one of the most popular products at the show this year. Um, and it's popular every year, but it's these, uh, so 72 inch legs is what we advertise. It's got removable caps this year. Uh, we extended it by about six inches. High quality, eight inch casters, um, four pockets on every side, and also E-straps. I mean, you're just gonna hear that as a continual theme with our product. These E-straps go all the way down on each side. So tables, chairs, uh, inflatables, tents, I mean, you can just, Throw this them on top awesome. of here and go up to three high in your warehouse. I can't believe I almost cut you short, bro. Yeah. This is awesome. So I everyone's even... trying to maximize warehouse space. So best way to do it is go up. This is cool. You got literally a rack at the bottom here just to oh, like yeah. raise it up a little bit so it's easy for the force to grab it. And it keeps the weight off the casters and also adds some ability. Ah, yeah. It keeps so the weight off the casters. When you're, uh, if you just have casters down there, it can move. But with this base, it's just, you know, it's rock solid. If you're stacking these things three high with 150 chairs in each one, you don't want that thing moving on you. Oh, so it's awesome. That's man. why we got the base there. So, yeah. Cool. You make everything for staging, too. I'm, I forgot I called you guys about for staging. No. Where are you guys located? We're in Northwest Ohio. Yeah. And uh, everything you see here that's made out of metal, we manufacture that. From raw steel to finished goods. So now remind me, does Bill Jacks go into yours or yours go into Bill Jacks? Uh, with uh, Bill Jacks, we're not exactly compatible on that. So okay, uh, you can't, you can't, uh, you can like line them up side by side, but you can't like uh, cross checker them or whatever it is, checkerboard them. Okay, so I thought, I thought that you had those like those cutouts yeah, yeah. over there, so they it could, could go it on there. It can work, but we just we don't say that they're completely interchangeable. Okay, That's gotcha. So you can, you can still hang them and stuff. So. All right. Yeah, well, thanks for stopping by, man. I appreciate you taking the time yeah. here to like, talk about this. And, yeah, yeah. Uh, can't wait to see the ARA show. Are you, gonna, you thinking about going to IAPA this year? Oh, we're going to be at IAPA. Yeah. Awesome. That big the, herc's going to be there. The oh. big herc will be yeah. at IAPA. Yeah. And probably in my garage. <laughs> <laughs> so, I would right. hope so. So, yeah, well, we'll be there. You guys have a good one. Thanks for watching. Yeah, appreciate it. See you, man. See you guys.